Hi guys, it's me, Mikey BJD Boy again, with a video, a uh, few updates, uh, whatnot, about what I've had going on. Um, so, this boy, Ollie, he got a new sweater the other day. I got it off of eBay. It's a really nice quality. And I only play, uh, paid maybe $12 for it. Um, and it had f free shipping. We love free shipping. So, yeah, it took a um, couple weeks to get here. But I think it's really nice. He likes it, so, yeah. And then I've been thrifting and finding dolls and these I cleaned up and put in outfits and I did find that the cam the creative monster uh, wigs will fit as well on these girls on the live dolls so and this is one of the plastics now, on these, this is a Create a Monster wig, and I think it looks pretty good on her. I redressed her in Barbie. But the shoes, that's where I'm having an issue, because they don't fit all kinds of shoes. So, yeah. And this, here's another Liv doll that I rescued. And this is a Mystic Girls wig. And they were kind of a mix between Bratzilla's and a few other, um, and Monster High, I would say. So, they kind of had that kind of vibe about them. I do have a couple live wigs that I need to do something with. But yeah, that's in the future. Um, I did find this is a live doll from a McDonald's Happy meal toy or happy meal it's the toy that they give out and so is this little mannequin kinda cute came in uh, those bags that I got the other day thrifting and I went to Walmart last night and I love Wonder Woman and here is the Wonder Woman action doll. She is Playline. And they had her for $12.88. And I love me some Wonder Woman. And so there's three different ones you can get um, this bow wielding Wonder Woman uh, shield block Wonder Woman and Diana Prince hidden sword Wonder Woman and this is the box that it comes in It's, it, for the price, it was a pretty good deal. Um, she does have articulation in her elbow. Not in her wrist, though. And in her, she has a more muscular, muscular kind of body. Yeah. 
even the thighs more muscular, more Amazon. I think she's neat though. And these guys, little outrageous littles. They are cute as can be. The clothes are plastic, so they slide on. And she's got white hair and Zulu knots. And this little one, she's got pink hair and Zulu knots. And she's in a roller skating outfit. And also, and they come, this is the egg that they come in and it turns into a stand and yeah um, some of them spit some of them cry some of them wet so yeah they're pretty cool uh, Walmart they have them for $7.97 if you can find them uh, these two I got from Kmart so, yeah, kind of been going a little nuts with that. Oh, if you follow me on Instagram, you know about Little Miss Sophia, our shrunken girl. She's eight inches tall, so, and her face is as big as my thumb and right now I have her in uh, Bratz undershirt uh, Barbie top here and then the fashion line the black line uh, Barbie pants I'm still looking for the perfect shoes they're weird because they her feet they jet out in the front so that's where the problem comes and I don't want to break her because she is resin and she's tiny and yeah I mean poor kid We'll find her shoes someday. I will, I will. I'm determined. So, and she's been hitting Barbie up for clothes and all these guys. And I'm like, okay, settle it down. She is a little bit of a fashionista, though, herself. So, and I just ran across my. Generation girl Barbie, and she does have articulation in the hand. She has black nail color, a thumb ring, really nice accessories, really nice smiley face, great hair. This is what Mattel needs to go to, you know, need to go back to their roots a little bit, so, yeah, this girl, she's giving me the Mrs. Beasley vibe for real, Mr. Mrs. Beasley finally let her hair down, I got her some boots, some clothes. Yeah, she looks pretty sharp. Rapunzel. But, you know, hey, she looks good. I'll keep her like this. And, uh, in our ventures, I found 
Actually, me and Leroy found this box, which it's a box. It looks like a book. And I could put a pillow in there and put small dolls like Sophia into this or a Yo SD or even Barbies or something like that I could put into this box. But the, I just thought it was so neat. And it was only $20. So that was a good deal. Good find. Good find. What else have I gotten going? Um, still waiting on my Miro doll, but I guess several of us are waiting on our Miro dolls, so yeah. And it was supposed to be out on Monday. Well, today is Thursday and still no email, still no we shipped, nothing, so I don't know. Um, and I do have a doll chateau moon in coming in from a very nice um, person that also has a channel here on YouTube. So yeah, and she's also on Instagram. And uh, I'll be doing an unboxing on that. Um, still waiting on Carter, but that's like knit one, pearl two, knit one, pearl two. It's doll zone, guys. Yeah, doll zone. Okay. So, yeah, but other than that, I think that's all I have going as of yet, but you know, there's always something on the fire, so I think that's all I had for you guys today. Kind of a short video, but just to pop one out there, say hey, uh, let you know what I've been up to, and show you some of the stuff I've gotten over the past few days, so last week anyway, so okay, well you guys have a fantastic evening. And we'll talk to you soon. All right. Bye, all.